The dry desert southwest is prone to infrequent but intense storm events causing the flooding of communities where urban and wildland areas meet. The intensity of those storms is increasing, putting communities at risk and causing damage that lasts for years beyond the storm itself. The increasing occurrence of wildfire further aggravates the problem. The Desert Research Institute and the Engineering, Research, and Development Center of the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers have partnered to reduce flood risk in these areas by developing tools that strike a balance between flood control, ecosystem restoration, and water supply. My name is Marcus Burley. I'm an environmental physicist at the Desert Research Institute. And so what we can see here today is um, all the sediment that's been washed away because of all the extra water we had after the fire. And for example, here this tree has been um, buried to some extent with all these rocks and all the soil you can, you can see around here because of all the extra water that came down uh, the channel after the 2013 fire we had up here on Mount Charleston. To solve the problem, researchers are studying why storms are becoming more intense and more frequent. Storms after a fire can cause not only flooding, but also devastating mud and debris flows. DRI and our partners are looking at ways to manage landscapes, restore vegetation, and to predict when and where flood and debris flows will occur to protect communities and minimize damage.